Yeah, you guys, thousands lined the streets here in Chinatown earlier this afternoon for the Lunar New Year Parade. The Ward's Alderman, who's the first Asian American to serve on city council, served as this year's Grand Marshal for the parade. Lunar New Year's about new beginnings. It's about getting your year off to an auspicious start and doing all of the things to bring in luck and happiness and prosperity. In a symbol of good luck, many donning the color red as they shared the joy of celebrating the Lunar New Year. I think it's beautiful, like everyone coming together to do this, and especially since everyone's celebrating Year of the Rabbit, and I was, I'm, you're, we're both Year of the Rabbit. Allie Kolb says she's never been to the parade before, and why she's here holds deep personal meaning. I'm adopted from China, so I thought it would be like a good way to see how Chinese people celebrate the New Year. This is very exciting for me. Sophie He lives in Indiana now, but was raised in China. She says this is also her first time attending, and it's a reminder of her cherished childhood memories. I grew up in a small town in China that like has this every year, so I never saw it special until I got here. Still, with joy comes a reminder of those who had theirs taken during a mass shooting at a Lunar New Year celebration in California. We had a community vigil last night. Uh, we wanted to really honor their memory and give that its own solemn moment um, and have today be for celebrating. In light of the recent events, several changes were put into place. 11th Ward Alderman Nicole Lee says that includes the choice to cancel fireworks. Typically, we would start the parade off with a big bang. Uh, but in light of the, the events of last week, it's appropriate to not do that. We don't want anybody to be nervous about gunfire or anything like that. While there was no intelligence to suggest any threats, officials say they brought in more security, including at the parade and on the red and green lines. It's just an abundance of caution, that's all. As dozens of groups and performers marched down the parade route, some including Chicago's mayor, saying this is what unity looks like. You can see there's a great enthusiasm uh, for the people here, and we need to unite around this community. Now, there will be other celebrations to continue in Chicago surrounding the Lunar New Year. Those go through February 5th. Reporting live in Chinatown, Courtney Spinelli, WGN News.